Okay, there's photosensitivity in this game, so everyone who has any of this, please be careful. I'm letting you know now. Well, well. Figured out a lot of things from the last time. The saxophone is what I'm just thinking. Tarnished saxophone. Still sings, though its owner is gone. Oh. We need to figure out more about this guy. And more about um, our relationship with um, Miss Mass. Guess we can go down this way. A dead end. Lots of stars, though. Leftovers from a dead Nova. A searchlight blazes, but Golden Boy is nowhere to be found. Oh. He's gone missing? Hmm. As the pull of gravity claws together clouds of interstellar atoms, tremendous pressure builds and a fire is ignited. The star is born in a halo of dust, its belly full of hydrogen, helium, and lithium. Inside, fusion digests this initial meal into progressively larger, heavier, more complex elements. Growing larger and heavier with iron, the star finally collapses and bursts into a supernova, unleashing a wind of rare, heavy metals in its dying breath. Now we're going to be discovering the elements, if I think about it this way. Not the swirl of his pompadour being the golden ratio. Oh my god. I didn't think about that, but yeah, his head is a black hole. Hey, it's the solar system. The star's gonna burst! Guess we're following this. Plans? Hunt. More footprints. Oh. Here's more. Oh, we made it to the end. Hmm. 
Oh, there's more lights. Hey, a cave. Hello. Oh, there's something here. Voluptuous curves carved into stone. Brings back vivid memories of the past. Oh, we're at a table. What's that? Oh, it's Miss Mass. Oh, she really likes us, huh? Eight zero six six five zero. Oh, that's the number we dialed earlier. Oh, her face got dismantled. our past. Golden Boy must have been very jealous that we were able to attract um, this mass. And that's why we have an awkward love triangle. These are like cave paintings. There's Golden Boy in the ceiling. Holy shit. we not be here? I guess not. Well, we did bother her from her work. But what do we do now? I, th I think there was a fort. Yeah. Maybe can we go in here? Oh! There's footprints! Oh, that must be from the lady that, uh, went into the water. Oh, Jesus. Hello? Hey. Oh, the development of hunters and gatherers. Hello. Hi. One's missing. Now all of them are missing. Hey. Nice.
There we go. Hello. Oh. Watch out. Oh no. No. What just happened? And that's it. The remains of a male creature born from the ashes of a dead star, fatally sought after. Feminine hands wish to possess it. After all this time, they collected all the bones and important stuff on it. This game has been, like, super ethereal. Like, it is so strange and weird in its storytelling, but I kind of like it that way. It's so weirdly ambiguous, but I, I kind of love it. We found the other horn. Or really another curl, too. A slight vibration, then nothing. A neutron star that has stopped spinning. Well, because it's going to die soon. The feelings of being watched overwhelms. Eyes look to the night sky and the stars proclaim that winter is approaching. An end of days is foreshadowed in the twinkle of, tw of dying stars and a harvest is gathered in preparation. Even subtler, subtler, yet more ominous patterns are witnessed through patient observation, such as the sacred cycle of eclipses, which occurs every 18 years. Those who return to the same location after three repetitions of the cycle will experience unforgettable awe as the heavens turn black. I've never heard of this before. Observe. Whoa! And then these two are left. Oh. Come on. Connect. There we go. Lights are ranged in the shape of a drum. The dancers perform myths of a great battle. Oh, here's another one. 
when I was very small, I, um, I used to really love looking up at the stars, but I think that's like everybody as a kid. A bottle illuminated by moonshine. The brewers raise a cup to the night sky. The thing is, is that, uh, when I was a kid, I did not know what were constellations. So I would make up constellations myself. So, and make up stories behind each constellation. But now I know what, what they are, considering I know a lot about tarot cards and junk like that and, you know, stuff in that sort. Stars form an animal from childhood fables. Infants giggle as its foolish hurry. Here's another one. Hmm. Guess not. I guess. I guess these two. A village made from the heavens. The builders haul giant stones to recreate its brilliance. That's really cool. I just love making these constellations. They're cool. There's another one. Points linked into the shape of a sinister hand. The healers burn amputated limbs in its honor. A timepiece made of celestial components. Priests pray that its light never ceases. Whoa! What is this thing? Heart. Distantly pulsating stars portray a broken heart. Mourners wail to the unending darkness above. Oops, I didn't read. Vibrations of visible light reach distant eyes and evoke a lyre. Uh, musicians compose a song as they dream. This is so heavenly. I love this. Hmm. Guess we connected to this. Oh, it's like a tree. Or maybe it's an arrowhead. It's a bird. Gravity has pulled matter together in the shape of a cosmic comb. Oh. Mothers weave celestial patterns into their children's hair. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, do they all connect? Twinkling stardust evokes sweet aromas. Maidens gather flowers under moonlight to cast a spell of attraction. Another one.
Brilliant lights form a bracelet lost in tragedy. Under its light, win widows ceremonially discard their jewelry. Jewelry. Hmm. The rings that uh, the ring that um, Golden Boy discarded earlier, I think, might be linked to what we just saw here. There's another one. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Comments fly by a dark celestial bird. Storytellers switch between a dove or a vulture based on their audience. Last one. Consolation of tree shades the world. Lovers create new life under its ample canopy. Okay. All right. A trail of stars embodies a serpent or a worm. Drew its quarrel about its portent. Fragments of the creator become celestial human figures. The dead take their place in the heavens. Hmm. This one just has two stars. Here you go. Burning suns mimic a lit intoxicant. The chieftains are placed upon a pyre and the smoke mingles with the stars above. Uh-oh. I think we're starting to... Because Golden Boy made his own basic universe. Basically, um, the culture is being... Well, praising him in a, in, a, in a sense. An ominous weapon that threateningly lingers over the world. Hunters make offerings of blood to it. Yeah, so I think Golden Boy, since he kills B Miss Mass and creates the Big Bang, I think he's accident he's basically created his own universe where everyone praises him in different in like different ways that even bleed to their own culture. That's crazy, dude. Wow. Oops. A star cluster to form a cornucopia of overflowing gifts. Worshippers pray to it for a plentiful harvest. This looks like the saxophone. Interesting. Oh, it's an upside down version of him. Like, his head is, instead of his hair being on the top, it's his beard. Whoa. My lord. This is their new god. We are the Eclipse.
A torch used to light a ceremonial beacon. A familiar photograph passed down through generations. The horn of a dead creature spirals into a bouquet of flowers. The many species should be catalogued. Why make your own religion when you could just, I don't know, make your own universe and everyone believes in you as the coolest dude alive? This is Stonehenge. I just realized this is like Golden Boy's version of Stonehenge. So weird. This is weird, man. We're getting closer to the end. A flyer. No. A cornucopia, an offering left on an altar. 